what's good, misfit, murder F gang. This is my dumb advice. What's good, misfit, murder gang? This is my dumb advice. Bow, the double shooters. What's good with y'all, man? How y'all doing? Back. We back like we never left. What up with the chat? How we doing in the chat? What's up, Aries God? I see you, baby. What's the vibes? Prop gang. How was y'all doing uh, after summer madness? Hey. Is it madness? Uh, How are we doing after the madness? Uh, we got ooh. some shit we need to speak about. Uh. Ooh. Yeah, 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 yeah. I like popping bottles. Let's yeah. go. I like Nancy hoes. Huh. I like fucking models. Huh. Out they fancy clothes. Hey. I lie, 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 I lie. I like popping bottles. What up, man? How y'all doing? Yo, live and direct. We here. We in the building. This is my dumb advice. I got the boy Ben Swayze coming through. We gonna chit chat a little bit about some of madness. Uh, you know, quick thoughts or whatever. And we definitely gonna address the um the matchups that they popped out for the Drake call. We gonna talk a little bit about that. Um, and yeah, we taking questions like every other day. This is what we do, man. Welcome to my family. If you're new to the channel, welcome. Uh, if you're a regular, welcome back. I appreciate everybody who be contributing to the prop gang. You already know the vibes. Um, I got some announcements, too, uh, that haven't came through last month to the top contributor. We do got some new winners, so I'm excited about that. Uh, but I want to let y'all know what I thought about yeah. it. Yo, Ben, what it is? Hey. Yeah. What's goody, though, B? I ain't see you in a minute. What's good, man? How you been, yo? For real, where the fuck you been at? Chilling, man. You know, every Sunday, still got the normal podcast show. Yes. And all that. Still packing niggas up every every week. <laughs> That's, you know? what's up. That's what's up. That's Regular what's up. shit though, man. Some of madness, man. We is is his here. What, 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 what are we doing? What are we doing with that? Like, uh, so so what was your thoughts of the night, man? Uh who you thought had battle with the night? Who was you impressed by? Well, you know, what you thought we was missing, what did we get from it? Like, I just wanted to know some of your like, you know, your thoughts on the on the joint. Yeah, fact. You know us, man. We chop it up all the fact. We watch battle back. We right. in the culture. You know what I'm saying? So like it's a little bit different for us. Like, I'm gonna keep it a band. Like, if I gotta keep it all the way a band though, mm -hmm. like, damn, and I don't really wanna shit on them, yo. But like, this was a little bit lackluster compared to some of the other summer madness. Like you like just to keep it all the way a hundred, people was arguing Civil War or Summer Madness, which mm -hmm. one was better. And I think Civil War won. Mm, I think okay. they won that argument, but you had some performances that was crazy though. Right, right, right. Who uh um, I, I enjoyed Easy and Chess. I thought I, I thought they was gonna have battle of the night and I, I feel like they did have battle of the night. But Absolutely. I did think Easy was gonna get it, but after watching it, I thought Chess won. Yeah, on the re Yo, I watch it's crazy because every I watched the replay twice already. See, I didn't and watch I the can't replay though. Yeah, I didn't I didn't watch the replay though. That was like, first I, watch. That, that first round, yo, like easy is just different. Different, bro. Like <laughs> the two say, different. you seen a little bit of DNA and started throwing up. Yeah, like, yeah, that's a fact. <laughs> easy be talking, nigga. What he said to you? Easy say, he said, move rings, the move swings. Mm. I changed with it. He said, you want to know after how I caught body after body when the coke started shape shifting? Yeah, that's a fact. Yo, <laughs> nah, easy way. Chess went stupid too. Both of them went dumb. Um, Surf surprised the shit out of me. If, he didn't surprise me because that's what Surf do. Right, right, right. But I didn't think he, I didn't think it was gonna be a thirty. Right, right. You thought it was a thirty? I didn't think it would have been a thirty. No, I thought I thought John John it was gonna be a little closer. I thought it would have been like a two one either way type shit. Um, yeah. I did not think he was going 30, 30 ball him, but he did. He showed up. Um, he did look like the the, the surf that battle Geechee. I thought, you know, the surf that battle Geechee was in good shape. And um, I feel like he he kind of came here on that same shit. The white tee. He's got the the memes of the white tee packs and shit. It's hilarious. Yeah. Man. Battle rap is different. White tee surf, man. I ain't going to lie. <laughs> Nigga told Smack. He said, you want one more? All right, mm. I got you. Stay right there. Right, right. He was in his bag. He was in his dump. <laughs> I think I think the crowd should have showed John John a little bit more love. Um, but... After a certain point, I feel like the crowd turned off. I don't know if it was me, but they were saying, "Oh, nah, it's just you, you just can't hear the crowd or something." They were saying that, but 
I felt like I was hearing them just fine before a certain point. It's like niggas just I mean, gave up. I mean, yo, in the building, I will say you hear it differently. Right. Like, it's been times I've been in the building, and depending on how the venue is built and all that, like, if it's, if it's, if it's like, it's, and that place looks huge. Mm -hmm. So maybe people that were standing next to the speakers or the echo and the whole building made it sound weird. But you, you're right. You definitely seen a change right after that easy and chest battle. Right. After that, it just, and niggas was probably standing on their feet all day. You seen a little slap. He was up there rocking <laughs> back and forth. Yeah, that little Yo, baby why they got there, that little like... baby outside at these hours, man? <laughs> he need to be in the house. What's going on, man? Niggas said Low Slap was at the home event till four in the morning. <laughs> then was at yo, bro. Yo, they gonna they call bugging. ACS on his ass. He better keep his baby in the house. <laughs> keep your baby in the house. For real, but, man. Um, yeah, Calico and Geechee. I don't know. It was a little. It wasn't where I thought that would end up being battle of the night, but mm. like you said, the crowd was weird. Reed and Mook, the diners. Oh man, yo! Mm -hmm. I don't know that what nigga the Mook, fuck. Yo, that nigga Mook be like, yo, bro. I don't know what be going on sometimes. Like those one of the battles that I kind of just spaced the fuck out. Like after a while, I'm just staring at shit and I don't know what's happening. He, like yo. The, and niggas was feeling the dollar scheme. I liked it until like he started bringing it back and all that. Fold the dollars, twin towers, cause I won in every corner. Right, right. Like yo, bro, my nigga, pack it up, bro. Why did he do the twin tower shit? Like why? Yo, <laughs> why did he and it's that? the car in the grass. When you fold it up, it's the twin towers, cause I won in every right. corner. <laughs> Put the pyramid in the middle. Like, yo, bro, you is killing me right now, my nigga. Oh, the first man. time it was like, oh, nah, this is, he going crazy. Then he brought it back. I'm like, nah, that's not it. This is not but it. See, but that's how I felt when he was battling rock that time where everybody was going stupid for his material. And I was like, it was all right. It wasn't like monumental to me. <laughs> like, it was good. But, like, I've heard better. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, all right. Yeah. Then you know how Mook do. Then he be like, pff, pff. <laughs> that was crazy. <laughs> like, yo, bro, no, it wasn't. <laughs> oh, Mook, yo, yo, Mook got that Kyrie Irving, like, them niggas, I don't know, bro. Them niggas, that, ever since niggas thought the earth was flat, mm. niggas been bugging out, yo. But... <laughs> Reed was no better. I'm not cutting Reed. Yeah, no yeah. slack either. Right. You was kind of bugging out too, Reed. Like, right. make him switch labels. He was a rock rider till he flipped mode. <laughs> like, yo, bro. <laughs> My nigga. Y'all niggas is up that here bugging out. was some 2000 out. shit. Like, you would have said yeah. that 19. Fact, yeah. I mean, well, I'll be surprised, though. I'll be surprised. Like, really? No, like, no, no. I wasn't even stoked about the battle in the first place. I'm like, I right, Like. Yeah. Why is this like the main event? Like, what is going on? Like, like to keep it all the way a thousand, I think the battle would have been better in a small room. Probably. I don't think they. I mean, not not much more, but I mean, but I don't why know. They was just they, moved. Why was they going crazy for MVP and real name Brandon? But give the Hollow and Shine low they energy. Was <laughs> they, they was outside since twelve o'clock. They 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 ate food. They was good. They got in the building. All right, this is the first battle. We hyped. Second battle, they was a lot of Luke Castro. Shouts to Luke Castro. Mm -hmm. Shouts to Luke Castro. Um, and shouts to Arsenal, too, because Ars he went from battling um, Cassidy. He battled Lux. And, like, you still giving niggas a shot, so I respect mm -hmm. that. Right. Um, and Lou's third, like, Lou just got, he got, he's a star. Like, when, when, when he pulled out the phone and Lou was just like, yeah, make sure you post that, like, Put my name, put my name on that. Like little things like that. What he told? What he told? What he say? Um, he said I heard John John was chasing surf for ten years and finally got him. Mm. Heard them niggas was chasing surf for two minutes, finally shot, shot him. him. I'm like, <laughs> I like that. But every every round he was like kind of getting better. Um, Luke Castro, he you started seeing he got comfortable by the third round, so. He gonna be he gonna be good bread on them big stages, but okay. the crowd they were showing love, and then it was like after easy and chest. Mm -hmm. I don't know, like that shit just 
Niggas started getting hungry. Niggas realized there wasn't no food in the middle, in the, in the building. Shit looked wild covid in there. Niggas said 3,000. <laughs> wild covid No, Smack was the only nigga with a mask on. <laughs> Nobody had on a mask. You know niggas wasn't vaccine. Right, right. So niggas is just up there just living life dangerous. But <laughs> um, that's why I said I ain't really want to shit on the event, but it's like, I, I was I was I was talking to niggas earlier and I was like, yo, was this event worse than Summer Madness Seven? Well that's the shit with uh Averb. No. With- so you want me to run down Summer Madness Seven? Yeah, which one was seven? Summer Madness Seven was Old Red versus Ill Will. When Old Red lost his voice, he had the dreams trying to drink the tea and shit. Yes. Twerk <laughs> versus DNA. Oh, yeah. When Twerk just he just didn't give a fuck. Mm-hmm. It was um who else was on Summer Madness Seven? I remember the Fucking team. Uh, um Av and Mad Papa. That battle was just lackluster. Yeah, it was, yeah, it was not good. Um Rex and Reed. Mm-hmm. That was the Mayweather card. That shit was ah oh, man like. The, so you saying it was better nah, than that? It was better than that. It was better than that. Better than that. It was better than that. But what about be last second. year's summer madness? Was it better than last year's summer madness? Last year's summer madness. That was the one with Verb and Cal, and um, I think Cal was on it. Yeah, Cal. Yeah, Cal versus Verb, Clips versus Geechee. Yes. That's when Clips was like, "Without John, John, and I'm yeah. gonna step up." Yeah, and yeah, my yeah. Feet on the wall, <laughs> bro. Cliff was blowing my <laughs> This nigga Cliff was blowing my own. It was the, the art of the, the in the moment freestyle. He was like, oh, Yeah, you know how Cliff oh started doing, God. yo. He started... that, that 106 in Park shit. Yo, didn't you and Mav do some shit like that? Like, I had like that. Yeah, we did. We did. We did to prove that you could really make anything, something out of anything. And if it's on the Yo, moment, it's gonna that? be fire. Hell yeah, we freestyled that shit. That's crazy. That was type I oh, that was type five. But it's so easy to do when it's not crazy. You know what I mean? Like if I'm yeah. looking at a keyboard and be like, oh, high key, bitches got me bored. Like it's so yeah. easy to do. But they all cat. Right, right. <laughs> <laughs> that shit is all cat. But when I control shit shift, like oh, <laughs> That's so easy yo, to do. Yo, it's crazy too, cause yo, this summer madness. You want to know something I noticed? And this is probably the first summer madness I think, and uh, I want to say ever. This mm-hmm. might be the first ever summer madness where nobody choked. Yes, yes, I think I saw you. It wasn't that. not one choke in that in that whole building and um and I'm in that whole event, Fresh. but it's still just. It wasn't all like I don't know, yo, because, yo, I was re-watching it, and I got to rewatch a lot more. I don't think niggas was that bad. I don't think John John was that bad. I don't think Geechee and Kyle was even that bad. Oh, how did I forget? Oh, Mark. How did I forget this? What's that? Yo, how did Surf get, I mean, how did hit, um, Sean get 30? No, that's what, oh. Sean got 30, and nobody want to talk about it. That's what I, that was my problem. So... When they put the camera on J Black and DNA, they was like, "Oh, uh, oh, uh, oh, uh, uh. <laughs> crickets." They didn't want to say nothing about Hollow getting the thirty, and Hollow thirty them, he thirty them, he thirty them, he thirty them. Now, then you know DNA. DNA's like, yo, sometimes you know nigga yeah. might spit the bars to nah. you, and it just might not resonate. Yeah, he thing. said, and that's what happened tonight. <laughs> that's not what happened. He said, tonight. "That's what happened tonight." <laughs> Your, Sean got and I fucks with Sean, I super fucks with Sean, but something something's not right. He but was that's up back there to back like losses rubber, though. Back to back, he was sounding like Rubber Band K, like back in the day, like when he was just rapping all fast and uh, you yeah. know Hollow Sean Kemp style. Uh-huh. Wow. He's mm-hmm. just getting to his little. I ain't gonna lie, Hollow was on his shit though. He's I like Hollow stuff. here way better than I did with him versus Nitty. Yeah, hollow, hollow with the curious George hat is different. I'm not gonna lie, he be, he be in his bag a little bit when he got the big yellow hat. He be in his bag, but he had him some shit. He said, "I load." He said, "I load up the old K." He mm-hmm. what he said? I hit him with. He said, "He said, he said, they said the AK spit faster than the old K." Yeah, facts, like facts. Hollow got some shit, but I don't, I don't know. I don't, I don't think Sean was that bad either. Though I just gotta see it again. He wasn't bad, it. but he wasn't that electrifying 
Sean that we see. He wasn't that that new Sean that we thought was more defined. That 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 the new style he created, like the the twerk and the that whole shit. You know what I'm talking about? That twerk style. He ain't have it. You know what I mean? And well, I don't know I what think, happened to it. Do you think fit that it's because because like that that whole COVID era and fuck some people up. And Sean was like, it's like once niggas started having to really, really listen to Sean in mm-hmm. them small rooms, you started realizing he started saying shit like, saying shit like, what he said? He said, make the vegetable switch names, turn them from a tomato to a tomato, a potato to a potato. Yeah. Like, yo, bro. <laughs> he dead said that yesterday. <laughs> I'm, not de- I'm not even making that up. Right, he dead yet. said that. Yeah. I don't know, man. I felt like the 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 for me, I thought twerk really made idioms famous in battle rap. Oh, Ben, where you at? Oh, there you go. Oh, you got me? Uh, you good? Yeah, got me. Uh, yeah. yeah. I I'm thought good. twerk really made idioms famous. Like people was doing it before. I've even touched on it. Mm. Like we all touched on it. But twerk was really fucking with the idioms. That's all he was doing. The yeah. you know uh the. the I, I can't even think of one right now. But everything Twerk do is an idiom. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Um, and then Sean started doing it a lot, just as much as Twerk. And then the Twerk delivery. Then I was like, oh, shit. I'm like, all right. But I'm not going to front. I liked it. I wasn't mad at it because yeah. he was winning. Yeah. And and he, I liked the bars. But now right. I feel like he just running out of those. That's it. That, mm. that That's just clear. Just... It's but, it's but so many idioms you could keep rolling with if it ain't your shit. And it's like to be to be honest, I'm saying like this is no hate on Sean, but like Sean's he neither he's not as witty as Twerk either. That's why Twerk Twerk's very he's very witty. You know what I'm saying? With with how he he come up with just shit that other people don't say. And yes. I think that Sean is not he doesn't have that in him. You know what I'm saying? But he like, was doing it though. He was. He yeah. was doing it. It was a point nobody was beating Sean. Nobody yeah. was beating Sean. And then he would do like little freestyles on the internet, killing it, just throwing balls away. I remember yeah. seeing him freestyling crazy balls, and I'm like, damn, this guy's just on fire right now. Like, he yeah. don't care. He just going off. He was scary. But watching that shit yesterday, he was not scary. I don't know what happened, but there was yeah. n- it was no scary in that. What? Oh, he, he cut his hair. He he got that. What's his name? Uh, the Samson Bro, effect. That, you know, when Samson that, they cut his hair, took his powers away. That man Sean went to the barber shop and said, "Let me get a number one." Like, yo, <laughs> that was the biggest. That was the biggest reaction that he had. Was his him hair, right? showing it? Was <sighs> yeah, showing he had his hair, off, but like, but Hollow wasn't like, like, like the whole yo. You didn't write that that Professor Sean shit. I didn't mm-hmm. think it was gonna hit the way it did, but people loved it. Well, almost it, because uh, Sean kind of almost admitted it. Yeah, he was like, "Yeah, you right, you right, you right." Right, like, like what? I said that. I said that in my predictions. I said, "Yo, Sean, stand there and don't say nothing because anything you say can and will Hollow, be used against you in the court of battle rap." <laughs> Hollow, he writes for if you say if you say something, and he writes if you don't say something. So. Yeah. Just stand there and shut the fuck up and let him rap. Fact. Cause, Cause he she did some freestyle it? on the spot too. He said, Oh, now you, I bet. This is what I'm gonna do with it. And then you know, you know Hollow. He could weave yeah. in and out of freestyles. Yeah. Yeah. Hollow is like Hollow's battle rap IQ is probably one of the highest. Yes. Like he easily has one of the highest battle rap IQs, but yes. I just think that you know, Hollow battles once once every two years, once mm-hmm. a year. So I think it's just the rust sometimes that 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 throws him off. Right. But he was um he was better than the nitty battle. I yeah. definitely say that. I definitely. He was think better than nitty true. battle, and I don't really know what's next for um Hollow. Like I don't really know. I don't. I know niggas don't want to see him and Mook. So. Yeah, I don't know if I want to see that. I don't really know. You know what I'm saying? I guess we just gotta kind of wait for that. But he won. Sean, Daylight already said that that battle's dead. They like said that shit is a dub. What? Said I'm not battling Sean. Why? Did he say why? He said that nigga was trash. <laughs> what That's he what he said. <laughs> well, I mean, it is, like it is. I mean, it's not. He ain't making his case no better losing to Hollow. 
So I, I don't know. It's if that's not even that happen. fact that he lost to Hollow because Hollow is Hollow. It's how he lost to Hollow. Like that was that was a bad shine, yo. Mm-hmm. And we've been getting bad performances from him lately, and I don't know why. I like, don't know why either. But then I think I, as a battle rapper, I could tell you this. And I and I say it all the time. Like sometimes you got it and sometimes you don't be. Like it's yeah. just is what it is. Like Yeah. I mean I could speak from experience. I mean, look, it be months. Yeah. I'm on fire. Craziness is coming out the everything's coming. It be another month, I can't think of shit. Yeah. I can't think of shit. And it happens. It really happens. <laughs> what do you think is Sean's problem? <laughs> yeah, I mean, I think that Sean feeds off the crowd. I think yep. that if the crowd would have been like more involved, you know what I'm saying? Even if it was a little bit of gas, he could have took that gas and ran with it. You know what I mean? Right. I think he was rapping too fast. I think that I think that he's been kind of overperforming his bars too a little bit, maybe. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Like he might need to just get back to like really trying to the like basics. Yeah, the basics and really like Work on your pen. Mm-hmm. Like, let them, you already know you can perform. Like, you don't have to work on your performance. Work on your pen more. You know what I mean? Because that's what's showing, that's what's hurting you, and that's what people are saying. People are saying, like, yo, Sean, don't be saying nothing. Mm-hmm. And, like, I think that's I think that's kind of disrespectful because I definitely think Sean be saying some shit. You know what I mean? Yeah. I don't know if he's like the tomato tomato type of shit, but he be having some shit. You know what I mean? Like, mm-hmm. he just got to get back to his pen. But um, that was bad. I agree. And I thought I thought Dietrich was going to wash Kyle. That's what and... I thought. That's what I thought. But before we get to Geechee, Sean, back to what you said about him feeding off the crowd, I did see him being frustrated with the crowd. Like, yeah. not getting the reaction he wants, and then it's fucking up his confidence up there. Yeah. Almost was like, ugh, he's like, hey, I'm just getting, I give up type shit. Like, oh, y'all ain't fucking with it. You know what I mean? And even yeah. Hollow into round three, Hollow's like, man, if y'all ain't going to react, then here, I'm going to just end it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, you can yeah. see people kind of getting frustrated. I don't know if, if that's how you felt, but that's kind of how I felt after a while. I, I, I said that in the, was it that battle? Or was it the Surf and John John battle? But I, I think it was that battle because I realized that shit. I'm like, yo, the, when they pan to the crowd, that, the people that was in that first row, they looked tired as hell. They was leaning on the gate. Like, yo, bro, you know you can't go get no nothing. They probably ain't getting nothing to drink because they don't want to lose their spot. They just been standing in one spot for hours, bro. And shout out to y'all, bro. They was running through the battles kind of quick. They was trying to. Yeah. Like, Smack was like, yo, it starts at 4 o'clock. 4 o'clock, the first battle happened. He would go to Jay Black and them, but right back, he'll be like, all right, next battle. Right. He was going kind of fast, but niggas ain't niggas ain't been standing up for an, for an event in two years. V, that shit. I mean, you know how that is. Up. You know how that is. At, yeah. at a battle, that shit yeah. is tiring. Every time I go to an event, I barely see all the battles. Keep it a thousand. I see maybe the three that I want to see the most, and yeah. then after that, it's clipped. I'm like somewhere else, doing something else. Yo, I'm going to sleep. Like I've literally going to sleep. Like. Like, I was I'm going to sleep at events. <laughs> I was at volume three. Like, I went to the couch, yo. Uncle Ra woke me up like, yo, we out of here. I'm like, we out of here? Yeah. What happened to Geechee versus Sam Sean? He's like, my nigga, you missed like two battles. I'm like, yo, bro, I was tired, my nigga. Like, <laughs> yo, keep it, keep it a buck. I went to, it was the same event, Cortez Battle Twerk. I fucking fell asleep that night. It was at Urban gone. Plaza too. And it was, was mad known. people around me. All I know, I just woke up and my girl's like, yo, you're you asleep. I'm like, what? <laughs> I'm like, yo, it's mad fans. Like, yo, fit is knocked the fuck out over there. Like, <laughs> luckily, we Niggas was over by quiet. like the VIP shit where it just be yeah, chairs. Nice. Oh, my God. But if not, niggas probably would have been fucking with me. Like, yo, look at fit. Look at nah. fit. First, yo, when niggas go to when we say we be knocked at events, we always somewhere in VIP or like right, right, right. to the side where we good, like where we know we can sleep in peace. Right, right. But still, right, like niggas that being there, bruh, I know niggas was tired, and they said that shit was like the, they said that shit was the most um, the most people ever. I don't know how true that was, but the most what? we gotta express that. 
no, Friends probably got the the, the exact amount of attendance. Oh, you know? they said it was the, the the biggest crowd. That's what I heard. I heard it was the biggest crowd, but mm. um, they definitely uh, like I said, Sean and Easy. I mean, Sean and Easy. Um, Chess and Easy though. I think um, Easy. I want to give us give him his flowers because. I'm going to keep it real, right? Like, I super fucks with Easy, Super, super fucks with him. He's been on my show mad times. I think Goods needs to... Wait a minute. I don't think Goods should take Easy just yet, yo. Mm. Goods should... Like, you got to be... You got to be strategic, yo, with certain battles. And right now, Easy got the glow. Mm. Whoever stands in front of him is going to have a real problem. If anything, I would let Goods let real sick battle Easy first. Cause they're the two top, they're the top two in the class, and real sick, lyrically is crazy. Yeah. So I would see how and real sick's angles are very very good. Mm -hmm. So I would see how real sick would attack easy, mm -hmm. and then you know what I mean. Hopefully some of that some of that that aura will wear off because right now that nigga's he on hot. fire. Yeah, he hot. Mm -hmm. He's on fire right now, and it's like I don't really know. You know what I'm saying? What I think I don't really know what Goods gonna say to him. Like that money talk might sound a little different to him. Mm -hmm. He's just just went up there and spit his fucking heart out all yeah. three rounds, and I might still have that shit easy three zero. Mm. I don't know. I I think Easy did a great job. I love performances on both sides, but I think Chess was really doing a little bit more for me each round. Mm. I, I think I think I gave Easy the. Did I give Easy the second? I think I gave Easy the second. I'm not mad at you. I'm not mad and at you. Then I, I gave the Chess the first, and then the third. I was like, "All right, we gotta see." Like yeah, I, yeah, that's yeah. definitely a rewatch a couple times because they both were going back and yeah, forth. I think I gave Chess the third. I, on first watch, first watch, I think I gave Chess the third, Easy the second, and I was saying the first was debatable. Mm. But then I watched it this morning before I did the show, and I was like, "Damn this." This nigga easy is wilding right now. <laughs> but chess, yo, chess, no. Chess is crazy, yo. Nah. Leave him ruthless like he signed a death row. Yep. Clean bean on the calico. Where's dreads go? Mm -hmm. Where's go? <laughs> yep, yep. I like yep. chess, B. Yeah. And then I, like I, I just like uh, I, I like what he was doing up there too. Like he was like, I miss y'all. It's over yeah. now. It's lit. Like I'm back in my element, and then I, I got yeah. that. Like he he was making. He was like, "Yeah, I, I, we're back. Like let's go." So yeah. I was like, "Damn, look at it. Like this is a passionate ass fucking battle. I like this shit. Yeah. Like, make yeah, it they count." Was hype, they was aggressive. Yeah. Hats is touching and all that. Yeah, niggas' hats is bumping. Facts. That facts. should be. That, Yo, that be easy that was right? even no bleeding lie. out the mouth. I'm like, how did this happen? Wait, what? <laughs> easy was bleeding. You didn't pee? What? No. Yo, Why he was, was he bleeding? I don't know what happened, but I know he was bleeding from his mouth. I don't know if he bit his lip. I don't know <laughs> if a chain hit him. I don't know if he got bumped. I don't know what happened, but he was definitely bleeding. Yo, I'm like, yo, not doing that, yo. Why he bleeding out the mouth? What <laughs> the fuck going on? And you know, yo, I was, was thinking bleeding. some other shit because they did have a little, like, this, like the camera went off them. They had like a little dispute, and then the camera went back, and he was bleeding. I was like, "Oh, they just kind of like sneak him." Like, <laughs> just I did not him. notice that. Yeah. Oh, yo, I know we just bounced. we all over the place right now, but I missed this part. Like, and I, I haven't rewatched it yet. Mm -hmm. But what? Why did Hollow bring out the boxing gloves? What was that about? <laughs> <laughs> he did though. I thought that shit was about to backfire on him. I really thought Sean was about to put him on, and be like, "Yo, what's popping?" But yo, I I, if, I think if he Sean would have hit him. <laughs> yo, I I don't know how that would have went. That's too much sauce. I don't but even know what bar. What I don't even know what bar he said when he brought him out though. But I know he brought him out like, "Yo, we could even fight," type shit. Like, if that's what you want to do, type shit. Like. What? <laughs> but then when Sean put the glove on, I was like, oh, wait, I don't think he planned for this. <laughs> <laughs> what if he hit him? What's going on? <laughs> abort missing, son. Abort. <laughs> what is going on? 
Yo, Yo. I don't abort this shit, abort, bro. It's not gonna son. go how you think it is. This is not it, son. Oh my god, Yo. now I want to know what was the bar. I'm about to fucking just play this. It was in the third round, right? Yeah, it was in the third. It was in the third. What did he say? I don't know what he said to make, to pull out boxing gloves. <laughs> what else? Oh, oh, that's literally the only one I don't got. <laughs> Yo. I don't Damn. Okay. Damn, got hollow. Yo, I, I don't think I seen I that got. either. Yeah. I got I gotta, only all of them except that one. Yeah, and the Geechee and Cow ship is acting stupid too. I ain't get to rewatch that one either. I'm gonna rewatch them throughout the week, but sheesh. So what did you think about the announcements? Uh got the super fight card, oh, hustle with our um, coffee. Hold up. They uh in the chat they said the ball was about um Sean acting tough in the face off. So he was like, you was acting tough in the face off, like, here, like, you want to get it popping type shit. <laughs> That's so I'm sad. Put that bitch oh, on. I was even more mad about the face off because Sean was so passionate that he had some shit he needed to address on how some, like, he made it seem like Hollow was the fakest yeah. nigga alive. And in the battle, he would reveal that. I didn't get no angle about him being the fakest nigga in the world or nothing, unless I missed it. That's what I'm saying too. Like, I'm not gonna lie, I'm gonna keep it dead dead a honey. Fi was at my crib watching the um battle, right? Fi pulled up. Yeah. He was up, he was at my crib watching it. And um, you know, I don't smoke, you know, Fi's a super pothead. Mm. But I'm like, all right, I'm gonna smoke a little bit with you. So I smoked a little bit of Zaza, straight mm. to the Mata. I was I was done. <laughs> <laughs> By the time I came back and that battle was on, I was a little spaced out. I'm not gonna lie, but I don't remember him saying nothing neither that really had me like. Like, oh, I'm trying to expose them, you know? Because he was really, it was to the point, like, the face-off, he was being yeah, so I serious. Know. I had to call Cortez, like, yo, what's going on with Sean and, and Hollow? Like, what happened? Like, what did I miss type shit? And he yeah. didn't know. He just was saying that, like, you know, like, Sean be <laughs> thinking Hollow fake, and he be doing fake shit or whatever. <laughs> yeah, he's like, I don't know, fake. I have no idea, like. Uh, <laughs> I'm like I was gonna call yeah. Hollow But he had the battle So I was like Alright let me just not Get him yeah. out his bag Or whatever I'm but. pretty sure You would've asked Hollow He would've been like Yo I don't know What this nigga's talking about Well I feel like He don't know And Sean got this whole Like like scenarios Built in his head <laughs> Like oh my god And Hollow literally Probably don't know What the fuck He talking about Like what you Nah he doesn't like, I know he doesn't bro like, like you read All the way into That situation Sean's a little different, you know what I mean? Sean, he, he makes himself upset he, before the battle. Like, he wants to, you know what I mean? Make himself angry so that way he can, like, really, really not like... Because I was there when they did the... When the battle kind of got set up, right? It was at Gnome 9. And mm -hmm. Sean just finished battling Nitty. And Hollow was just on stage, you know what I mean? Just spectating. And Sean just out of nowhere was like, I'll fuck you up. And, you know, they was just laughing. And Hollow was like, nigga, like, as you know, smack. He like, nah, stand right here, son. Like, nah, 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 stand right here, son. Y'all want to see this? And everybody went crazy. And that's how it kind of, like, first, like, started getting spoken of. But Hollow did, was, I'm pretty sure Hollow wasn't even thinking about Sean right. at all mm -hmm. before that point. And I'm pretty sure that there was nothing that built up to that. So, I don't know. I have no idea. Sean is... But Sean got to go back to the drawing board. Yeah. Because go is, is this, board. I, I, I said it was two losses back to back, but then somebody said three losses back to back. I, I no, he, he lost to Chilla and he lost to Hollow. It was nothing before that, right? Yeah, I think before that was Pat Stay. Oh, Pat Stay, Pat Stay. I don't think he lost that battle. Yeah, he, he didn't lose. It was, just, it, was, it was just a bad Pat battle. Pat Stay didn't prepare some shit. It wasn't right. Sean's fault. Right. Like, yeah, so it's not I do yeah, but I do think that um, as far as the ultimate madness shit, I think that they need to just keep them niggas off those type of stages, and just let y'all niggas, bro, get the get the twenty five k on caffeine mm -hmm. or maybe on a super fight or something like that. Like, I, bro, y'all niggas you just that? wasted because like them niggas was getting mad love and all that, but that that battle was trash, yo. I'm gonna keep it dead funky. Yeah. That nigga MVP was not it. 
Dude. And real name Brandon was just good enough to beat him. Mm. That was a wasted. That that that's one more life you just took out the crowd that could have been used for one of these other battles. Yo, and I said if dragging it was a person, it'd be dumb too, motherfuckers. Cause they dragged every second of that battle, bro. The like, battle was like an hour oh and a half. My God, I'm like, bro, the shit ain't even that hard. Get through four balls, go, man, rap. They stop I after the every thing. ball, like. Every I get this is your first room. time on a big stage and you excited, but son, yeah. carry on now. Carry on. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> we got shit. All the walking back and forth, the drinking water between every bar. They was they was nervous. I get it, but it's just like I got the pacing was just horrible. Pacing was horrible, <laughs> and I don't think that you know. I mean, it's 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 dope to show that you give a niggas a chance, but. Bro, giving niggas a chance for other people's time, bro, because I'm I'm not here for this. I'm here. <laughs> Facts. We here for the I'm main here events. To, I'm here for main events, man. What about said Sir said? He said, what he said, he said, rock. Soon as you kick in the door, he said, he said, soon as he said, he said, bow, soon as you kick in the door. He said, um, he, he said, explore the shit, foreign shit. He said, make sure that he said, don't kill a dog or the fish. But he said, but if that motherfucking bark or that water swish. He said, he said, he said, lock the door. Eh? Give his daughter a kiss. Bow, shot through the hallway. Thought I saw some shit. Yo, what is he said, witchcraft you want? Bars performance? A source of shit. Yo, he was who, wilding who on that? dope. That was surf. That was surf. He oh. was wilding on John John Low Key. Cause I had to rewatch it because I'm like, yo. I'm like, yo, is these niggas just gassing him? Cause sometimes oh, the only time they miss the wave. You know how surf dudes fit. Like sometimes he getting his Asian fish, Asian dish, raiding shit, and I don't always like that shit, bro. Like, <laughs> but young, young Asian dish was wilding yesterday. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. He always you say got young those... Asian dish. Yeah, I call him young Asian <laughs> dish because he always got some bar like that. Chinese food, Chinese food. Like, a chi like, like a Chinese dish, slant sideways like a Chinese chick. Like yo, bro. Like yeah, all right, yeah. all right, sir. Now nah, he was going he off. He was rallying on John John. He was going off. What was my favorite bar? That, you know, I, I, you know, oh, oh, the, 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 the multiple choice was crazy. That was crazy. He said, he said, my he said, judge tried to give me, judge tried to give me word and that, that. My, my lawyer said none of none the above. Of the above. <laughs> what? He said A, life, B, some shit. <laughs> said none of the above. <laughs> Crazy. Yeah, John, 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 I think, I don't know, man. I'm, I got to rewatch it because I want to see where he really fucked up at. Like, I know in John? my predictions, John? yeah, John, I, in my predictions, I thought John was going to really, like, have some shit to say to him. And somebody called me today earlier, though. Somebody called me earlier today, and they think John, John won. They said mm. that John, John got the second. That's tough. And what other round? I think he, they said the third. They think they edged him the third. They said that surf bars was for anybody. Mm. If you want to get stacked in the cold. <laughs> I don't know about that. I think. But uh, who was spitting John's, the better shit? It was surf. Yeah, John's best round was the shit where he had people going with him. You know how he was saying, you are not bigger than the culture. To have yeah. the crowd say that, that's real good crowd yeah. control. And you got to give them points for that. You know what I mean? It's real hard to do that, especially in a crowd that's already losing steam. You know what I mean? They're already yeah. lackluster, like, all right, all right, for, for me to repeat But John, you. John, uh, I, I, yo, as much as I fuck with y'all, I super, 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 super rocks with John, John. Like, mm. super rocks with him. But I got to keep it funky. John, John, you said, my nigga, you said... That if we bet on you, mm. that we gonna win that money. <laughs> oh my nigga, that was not a performance that I feel comfortable betting on. <laughs> I do not feel comfortable with that bet. I do not feel comfortable with that bet. You, oh, that's what he man. said. He was like, "Yo, if you bet on me, house. don't worry about it. Your money is safe." Wait a minute, didn't they bet like like ten, five thousand or some shit like that? Them two. Each other, yeah, they're on the face off. I think they oh. they 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 put a wager up. Oh no! And then how would you judge that? How like based on crowd? <laughs> John John know he lost. You know you I mean, you're not gonna know. say it, but I mean gotta I gotta rewatch it. 
I, I try I tried to save Jar Jar earlier today on Twitter. <laughs> I tried to spit like some of his bars and all that, you know what I mean? Put some of his quotes up there. Niggas was not having it. Niggas is like, yeah, that nigga, he said all that and died. I was like, damn. Then I, because I was, I was putting his bars as I was rewatching it. Mm. So the first round, I'm like, yo, this nigga's not getting no love and he's going crazy. And then I watched Surf first round and I was just like, yeah. It's over. It's over. It's over. John John was a good nigga. Oh, uh, I'm seeing people said it was 20,000 a bet. Was it? They said it was 20,000, but it wasn't confirmed. My nigga, them niggas, neither one of them niggas is giving away 20000 for no fucking three rounds of rapping. Them niggas is trying to sell a fight. I've yet to see one of these battle rappers uh, really bet. try to do that. Yeah, them niggas is, them niggas is capping. But yeah, it's definitely not that, 200K. Um, yeah, well, yeah, I not. think that, I think the event as a whole, I think I gave it like a five out of 10 mm. just because, um, you know, main event, like we got to still... I can't, yo, I can't imagine how much Mook and Reed got paid for that battle, yo, for that type of performance. But see, this, Ben, this be my problem with my ask. When I ask yeah. for some bread and you give them top dollar for that, it's a slap if, in the face. If you want to get into that, if you want to get into that, we can get into that. You know what I'm saying? It's because a slap this in your the show, face. And it's like, I, I don't like, that's why early out today, you know what I mean? Like, it came up, like, we I didn't plan for you to come on, you know what I mean? I was just like, yo, Fit, pull up real quick, because I don't like that narrative of, oh, Misfit is ducking. Right. And I'm like, yo, why? Why would Misfit duck a battle with Jazz? Like, what does she, what does she have to be scared of? Like, right. Fit has battled some of the best ever, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Like, why does she be, oh my God, like... Nah, I can't take jazz right now. Like, why? Right. And it's, everybody would debate. With everybody would debate officials the best of the Bardashians. And I battled official. And official body jazz. Like, why would I battle O and be scared to battle jazz? And I just think, I keep telling them, like, yo, <laughs> Finn has, says this, has said this numerous times. Like, I don't know why y'all keep ignoring her when she say it. Mm. Pay me what I want. I'm asking for. I have a set price that I don't think that y'all should lowball me on, and we can lock it in. It's right. as simple as that. Right. Very like, simple. and you know, I, I just feel like with Jazz is making this shit kind of corny, and it's almost like Jazz is um ducking the situation. It's like she's not fighting for that same thing. Like, yo, we deserve a. Both of us deserve a bigger bag. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, we're the. We could be a main event on a Queen of the Ring. Or a main event on a super fight, or on one of these summer madness gnome cards. So pay us what we want. The, and if, if she vocalizes that as well, then the fans are gonna be like, "Wait, that's the only thing stopping the battle." Right. Then they go. Then we all gonna be on URL's right, ass right, or right, Queen right. of the Raven, whoever gotta cut the check. But see, but, she, it's two reasons that don't happen. One, she's satisfied with whatever they're giving her, right? And I just know my ask is more than. All the other girls is ask because they clearly mm. just taken, like you know, I don't, I don't want to shit on them because I I know take pennies on the dollar. I know most of they, most of their numbers, but like it, it's stupid. Like I right, cool, I get business. I understand business. I know how shit works. I understand when there's no budget and when there is a budget. But at the end of the day, yo, this battle is a better battle. Well, at this point, like I'm talking about how it was all heated up. At this moment, I'm like. Whatever, man. I, I I don't give a fuck. If it come, they give the plate, I'm here. You know what I mean? If, you, if you're going to cash the check, cool, I'm with it. But, like, right. what I don't like is that, oh, like, out of nowhere, oh, I'm ducking. The problem is every time, like, we just did an interview together at, at an event. And clearly, 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 it was no, oh, misfit ducking. It's never right. like that when I'm... I'm I'm around. Yeah, you did. It's always like, oh, Miss Fiducan. I don't know if she wanted to make the conversation interesting or whatever she wanted to do, but you know, it don't matter to me. I feel like the real people, real fans and shit, should already know. Cause how many times we gotta say it? It's not the matter of not wanting to take the battle. It's not. It's the matter of all right. This is what I asked for. I'm just waiting on it. That's it. Right. And at this moment, Gaddis is more affordable, and 
why, as a business, if you feel like, okay, I can get this person for cheaper and I can get Jazz to come out, why not? And yeah. so I don't, I don't, I ain't mad at them for doing that. Bravo, do your thing. You know, the show must go on. But, I, you know, don't make me look like I'm like running from the shit. Cause, you know. Yeah, she like threw your name out there out of nowhere. Yeah. It's Cordy, like, you know what I mean? Nobody smacked this. Nobody said, yo, what's up with the Misfit? Yeah, you know, since Misfit ducking. Yeah, right? Like, I'm what? I'm like, yo, where did that come from? <laughs> yo, I got tight instantly, like, yo. Right, right. I just trying to throw my sis under the bus, and, like, you know this is not the situation. Correct, like, correct, correct. Like, correct. what are you talking about now? You, now, if you go up there and get your dumb ass smoke, then that niggas really ain't going to want to pay back. So, now right. I got to, now you got to kill Gaddis. Yes. Just so that way the fans can be like, all right, now. But you know it is what it is. I mean, but then it do make sense for her to have a a, a a spa before she fucking come for me, because I did come back out. You understand? Yeah. I came back out after after five years off, and I took a couple battles. Right? You know, I, I battled. I did. I did the Farrah battle, which I felt was groundbreaking in the moment where female battle rap was at at the moment. It was nowhere. Yeah. It was nothing yeah. happening. It was ghosts. Right. And then no caffeine at the time. it was ghost, no, no caffeine, none of that. And then, um, I battled official right after that on the born legacy card. Um, yeah. and, and I then had we never, went on into COVID. And, and, yeah. And, and then I, and then I did the tour too with Cole and Geechee. So, right. That was a lot. Yeah. I forgot about and that. And she too. hasn't battled in how many years? So in a way, I do feel comfortable with her coming and and at least let me see what you got at this point, right? Are yeah, you still yeah. are you still all right? Like, are you still rapping? <laughs> like, <laughs> you still good? Like, are you still you know? And I personally never thought she was this crazy. You know, I never thought mm. she was wow crazy. I just thought mm. she was very um popular, right? She was popular. Yeah, star power. Yeah, she, she, she was popular. Power. Yeah. So like, if you're popular and everybody, you know, you got a lot of fans behind you, that's always a battle I love taking. Oh yeah, I want to battle a bitch with mad fans, so that when they lose, you know, it's kind of like the bigger they are, the harder they fall. And I've 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 moved in my career like that my entire career. It's like, oh, a chick getting mad buzz, cool. Let me get that. Let me body her shit, and then it's like, oh, you know, fit going to, up against. Gorillas, not no regular battle. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I, I mean, I, I, never I would never, I would never, I wouldn't discredit, I would never discredit Jazz on the fact of like, you know, she if she was if I thought Jazz was trash, then I would be like, yo, fit. Why are you even like taking this back? Why, why would like this battle makes no sense? Right, you know what right, I'm saying? Right, like, right. she, she, she has a name and for a reason. You know what I mean? Like, mm -hmm. she's battled E Heart, she's battled, she's battled big names as well. She has, but she I just has. think that. These other battles, like this goddess battle, makes no sense at all. Like it's right, just right. like, and you know, what I mean, I think people are just so thirsty to see her. It's just taking the battle just to take battle, a battle. Yeah, 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 they would have been like, "Yo, battle, uh, who? Oh, uh, what's what show did I just battle? Fucking Farrah. Um, um, see what's the, the boss. See the yeah, boss. battle. See the boss. Like y'all both from Brooklyn. Right, right. Like yo, set. It would niggas wouldn't give a fuck who she would have battled. So yeah. And this niggas is like, yo, Drake hand picked this battle. Yeah, that's Ooh, funny Drake too. Did it, bro. <laughs> like, that's funny too because we know it was it was booked already for a little minute. <laughs> niggas just told me that that battle was supposed to be on, um, on the last Queen of the Ring event. Yes. So yeah. what are y'all talking about? Drake hand picked this battle. I mean, they selling the fight, man. It is what it is. You know? I know. I just be. I, you know what? I, I be trying not to get frustrated about certain shit because it's like. <laughs> You know, it's like WWE. They just yeah, selling the shit. Yeah, they, they, they're selling the fire. And you can't be mad at that. You know what I mean? At the end we'll of the day, I do think Gaddis is a uh, a contender. And I think Gaddis is definitely one of the first chicks to do it. You know what I mean? Like, when yeah. I came in it, I had seen a battle from, from Gaddis and shit. And people yeah. always was trying to, like, throw those names in the air. Like, oh, fit, what up with you and Gaddis? Uh, she still want to see me somewhere down the line. I just felt like... Our paths never really crossed because we kind of was just never in it. Like, yeah, I, I feel like when I'm wilding, she's off, and when I'm off, she's wilding. You know, it's always kind of been like that. Um, but yeah, man, I just don't like, I just don't like people coming to me with the jazz shit. At this point, y'all had like just the fans, just everybody watching. 
you have to understand, like, as a battle rapper, like, jazz is not, like, my life. You know what I mean? Uh. <laughs> Nor is she, like, like, you know what I mean? Like, she's not what I think about in the morning. Like, it's not that serious for me. Um, I just didn't like the talking. You know what I mean? So I wanted to shut that up. You know what I mean? Like, oh, yeah. shut up. Like, you're not I mean, better than me. To be honest with you, that's the only reason why we're talking about it. Like, if she didn't... Yo, if yes. they would announced it, I mean, I'm pretty sure if they would have announced it, your name would have still been brought into it somehow, some way, mm -hmm. just because people want to see that battle. Mm -hmm. But I don't think it would have been as big, but she, like, literally just said your name. Right. Like, like out of nowhere, like, like, and I told her, I said, yo, saying, Jazz. Gattis wasn't up there saying, like, yeah. I told you know Jazz personally, Ben, I swear to you, I hit her up on the phone. I said, yo, stop talking about me. You <laughs> gave me tight. Stop talking about me. <laughs> and she told me, after the after the uh, top tier dish, she not going to say nothing else. And I said, all right, say less, because I'm going to body you on that record, too. <laughs> and I bodied her on the record, too. Yeah, you are cold and crazy close. on that. Not even close. You are so cold and crazy on that. I thought that was it. Still talking, Jazz. I'm not talking. I ain't saying nothing no more. I don't want to talk until Beasley hit me up and be like, the battle's going down. Because we did too much talking. I don't want to talk no more. Yeah. It's, it's, it's getting boring. You know what I mean? Yeah. At first, it's fun. It's like, all right, cool. Like, this is exciting. We going back and forth. But, you know, it's yeah. a thin line between going back and forth and then being annoying. Like, look, just don't talk about me until the pen and paper is out and we are ready to sign them deals and get a yeah. battle popping. You know what I'm saying? Because um, yeah, I'm ready fun. for the smoke whenever they try and pray, pay for it. You know what I mean? That's it. That's it. Nothing else need to be said about that, man. Like that's that it is what it is. Dude. Oh, but and, and I think I saw I, I saw uh the OTF page. They posted some shit that I think uh Miss Miami and, and Stamp Stamp is her boyfriend, right? Yeah. I, I guess they was doing some little live or whatever, and he was talking mad spicy about me, like oh Miss for this trash type shit, and I'm like son. Who are you? Like, I only know you because you <laughs> failed to back your wife up. That's all I know. Like, I, all I know is she was like, where's Stamp at? That's all I know. You want, you want to know who Stamp is also? <laughs> Stamp is the dude that when the, the white dude said nigga in the battle and got punched in the face, uh -huh. Stamp is the one that was with him that tried to fight the other black dude. <laughs> so wait, yeah. Stamp was with A the white, white guy? Dude? Yeah, he was with the white guy. The white guy said, nigga, the black dude punched him in the face. Then Stamp moved the white dude out the face and tried to swing on the black dude like, yo, and squared up with him. Oh, and then was like, yeah, Stamp is, these niggas be weird. Yeah, I don't even be, I don't even be watching these niggas or like paying these niggas no attention. Oh my God. Yo, me talking about it gave that, that live more attention than what he did. Cause when, when they, they added me on it, I'm like, man, why you ever add me on this shit? Then you know yeah. on Instagram Live, you can see the viewers. This shit said yeah. eight viewers. <laughs> How dare you talk about me when you got eight people watching your live? If you don't get the fuck up out of here. When was this? When was they talking about it? Uh, it was like what? It was like the other day. I felt like it was, it was right before the battle. Like two days ago. It's like two days ago. Or whatever. Two days ago is when I saw it. Um, I would have never even noticed. I, I don't never even know what she was nothing. talking about. All I know, basically, <laughs> she was talking about jazz, and she was like, oh, jazz supposed to battle Misfit, but they don't want to give Misfit bread. And then Stan was like, oh, Misfit ain't worth no bread. I, I. Like, how are you talking all of this, and your wife is Miss Miami? Like, stop. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> like, they, on, they off they rock. Yo. Be yo, I don't even, yo, they, I don't know, man. Some niggas, they, people don't need a platform, yo, to talk. Like, I just, <laughs> I wouldn't even, like, like you said, niggas had eight fucking followers. Now people probably gonna go watch that shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, probably, yeah. Like, I, I, it's all good. It's like, I gave them more niggas, attention. Niggas, cool, niggas, you know what I mean? Boys. It is what it is. But, like, I, I never really be mad at people's opinions of me. You know what I mean? Um, yeah. It because we know this the culture, Ben. Nah, but they trash though. They we, dead we, trash. We, like they don't even need to be. So we just we, we know the culture, and it's just certain people that shouldn't even have me. On yeah, like, why you even like, like I'm the 
like, like worry about what? your career and your girl career yes. cause like yes. that yes. shit is in the dirt right now like Thanks. like if, if I'm not worth that then what do you think she's worth right right she's right probably like and we're not gonna act go like to... I'm not like light years ahead of sis like we're not what are we doing <laughs> like we're, we're not mentioning the same conversations Yo, oh, man, it's but, nasty. It's nasty. It was, it was, but uh, let, let me not shit on sis, the... man. Let me not shit on her, cause you know I never had an issue with her. But her man was talking a little crazy. He's Too a bozo. Much. He's a bozo. Um, but that event, what I wanted to say though is that even though it was like you know what I mean, lackluster or whatever, mm -hmm. I think that I was still highly enjoyed seeing the crowd back though, and seeing a big stage that that battle is on a big stage again. Like it felt like a. Cause like RBE, they they've been back with big events, but it's still it's different with URL. Shouts to RBE mm. and everybody over there. There's no, no shade to them, but it's always just a different kind of feeling with URL. And you know what I'm saying? Just seeing Smack on that big stage, yeah. seeing you know what I mean. So, yeah. um, it's going the the big stages is back. So we're gonna see, man. We're gonna see how this go. Yo, uh, what do you think about the the KO uh, TD joints? The ones that just uh, passed. So I haven't been watching them, yo, because to be honest, like they asked me to be a judge again. You know what I'm saying? Like I was supposed to do a lot of work with King of the Dot, but I had to just like, that shit was taking too much of my time. And Sundays, I lost fantasy football last year. It'd be like almost a thousand dollars on the line. What that I need be to be about? Locked. What's that about? What, fantasy football? Mm -hmm. It's just like, it's like a draft at the beginning of the season. Everybody picks like a quarterback, a running back. A wide receiver, or like in basketball, they can you pick, pick a your own team that that you feel like is going to be but, good. Right? Yeah, but it's a draft though, so you gotta like you gotta draft them. So like, if if I got the fourth pick and I pick like fucking Tom Brady for instance, right? Then Tom Brady's on my team. You can't, you know what I mean? And mm. it just everybody goes through the whole through the get their whole team filled up. And like I said, it's a th I'm in five leagues, it's like six hundred dollars here, thousand dollars over there, five hundred dollars over here. I gotta be locked in, man. I'm already a big football fan, but I gotta win this money in every league. So yeah. I told King of the Dot. I mean, Sundays I haven't been watching the events, but I've been seeing a little bit of um, a little replays or whatever. It seems like it's, it's a lot of money on the line. I don't know, man. It's been looking real, for lack of a better word, dirt. Probably. I don't understand. I was so bad, like. Like, I saw passwords do well, and then every other shit that I saw was kind of doo-doo. But that's that. Yeah, it, it's, been, yeah. it's been like that. I mean, And they got 50000 on the line, but they just, they going about it weird. I don't know. I don't know. But... It's, it's nasty over there. Yeah, but... <laughs> but I'm about to get up out of here, OB. Yo, man, good looking, man. Appreciate sleep. you coming through, chit-chatting. Always. Um, we got to go out and get a drink, man. I know we keep saying that, but that ass, that ass. World up. Yo, man, I just came back from Cabo, man. When's your next trip? Where we at? Oh, world? How was yeah. it? Cabo got this was, you on a trip. It was lit. Got me a nice little tan, you know, chilling with Beloved <laughs> over the sun, you know? It was fun. It was cool. Them trips be it, man. I was, uh, my next trip, I got to go to Miami. Mm. I got to go to Miami, and then I got to go to a wedding in Jamaica. I, I don't know, Jamaica, babe, babe, what's man. the, uh, Damn, what's I the, what you going to, babe, what's the next trip we going on? What's the next vacation we going on? Oh yeah, Belize. I'm bugging. Oh, I, I can fuck with Belize. When you going? Yeah. When we going to Belize, man? April. April. Baby, going to Belize in April or no? We can make it happen. I'm I'm gonna, I'm gonna hit you with the details. Yo, give Ben some love. Don't show some props in the chat for Ben <gasps> motherfucking Swayze. Hey. Show some love. Uh, new right, new podcast. Man. You already uh. in vibes. Yo, let's let them go, know go, where to catch the uh. pod, Ben. Yeah, yeah, yeah. To the channel, new era, new era podcast on YouTube. We also on Spotify and Apple Music, Apple Podcasts, whatever. But yeah, man, subscribe to the channel, show some love. Every Sunday, the um episode drops every Monday, and you already know, man. Holla at me, fit. I love you, B. Hi, right, my guy. Holla. Uh, oh, yeah. Everybody, that was Mr. Ben Swayze chit chat with me about summer madness and slow poquito with a fuckery. You know what I mean? Lil poquito with a fuckery. So, yeah, as we was talking about summer madness, thought it was a decent event. 
Uh, shout out to the staff and everybody, uh, for everybody who put it together. You are real specially. Shout out to Bees. I know he be, you know, behind the scenes making shit work. Um, and Caffeine, too, man. Caffeine has really been blessing us with some quality production. So, shout out to Caffeine. Um, but what are you guys' thoughts? Let's get in with the chat. Chat, how we doing, chat? What's going on? Chat, where you at? On the map, prop game. Prop huh. game was good. Hey, Throw a prop in the chat. Let me know you alive. Let me know you uh. in the live. Woo. This how we do it? Let's go. Uh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I like popping bottles. Yeah. I like nasty hoes. Yeah. I like fucking models. Uh. Out they fancy clothes. Hey. I lie, I lie, I lie, I lie, I lie, I lie. Mellow, what's the vibe? I like, I like popping bottles. I see somebody I like gotta get sniped with I like fucking models. Somebody getting shot they fancy clothes I like on I like, I like, I like, I like, I like. Y'all know the snipers is out You know what I mean? If you're new to the channel I just gotta let you know There's a couple ground rules If there is disrespect Any disrespect towards me You will be blocked And there will be nothing else to talk about Um, also most of the time, if you mention a certain battle rapper, you have to cash at me $10. That, of course, is if I mention them first, you're good to go. But if any time during the live chat you mention Jazz the Rapper, you have to cash at me $10. And then put in the description, Jazz Mention. All right, guys? Uh, so just let me know if somebody got to be sniped. I got you, all right? I got ya. I got ya. I mean, so whatever questions y'all got, put it in the chat. And, of course, y'all know Liz holding it down. Liz always holds it down um, and get the questions to me. <clears throat> but, yeah, man, a uh, big shout-out to the winners of the event. Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Alright, bang, 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 we got it, we got it, uh, just so I could, so I don't forget, I did, uh, tweet it, the, the people I thought who won, so, I just read y'all the tweets, pretty simple, alright, cool, so, I thought out of the, uh, the UN4 battle between Real Name Brandon and MVP, I thought Real Name Brandon took the battle, but I thought they dragged the shit out of that battle. They dragged that shit like they couldn't drag no more. Uh, it was a little, like, cringy. Because it's like, come on now. Like, let's carry on. Let's go. Repeating. Bringing it back. And I know how that is, right? Because when you get crowd reaction, you trying to let it settle. You don't want to fuck up your place. You want to reiterate. You, and when people react to something, you want to get that reaction again. So you bring it back. And it was the first event. It was, I mean, it was the first battle. So it was a lot of high energy in there. So they was taking advantage of that. But hey, for future reference, get through your material clean and get to the point. Please get to the point. God damn boy. Shit was dragging like a motherfucker. Please hold. Dragging it. They were dragging it. Ah. Uh, ah, right, y'all. Back. Sorry. Uh, all right. What was the question? Do y'all think the purpose of the card is cool? What do you mean, purpose? Uh, how do you feel about Biden and the Haitians at the border? Um, here's the thing. I, I, I don't know as much as I should on that topic, so I, I don't think I would be the most qualified to answer that question with the amount of information that I have at the time. Um, but I have seen... Uh, like, I saw something today, how uh, there was some uh, Mexicans helping out Haitians at the border, feeding them and, and grilling and shit. I thought that was cool, man. And I, and I feel like every time we stick together as a community, we do better, bigger 
things and we are unstoppable. You understand that? We are unstoppable. So just wanted to keep that in mind. I saw that. So big ups to them. But um, I, I would like more to know more on the topic. And um, I, I would make it my business to make sure I'm educated on that uh, because I don't know as much as I should. And, you know, I would have liked to answer that question. Unfortunately, I feel like I can't. Um, all right. So it said fit. They asking about the high stakes card where loser had to sit out of URL. Oh, I see what you mean. Huh? Oh. Oh. My fault, my fault y'all. All right. A two year sit. I don't know how true that is. I I don't know if they gonna do that. Really wish other say the same as fair, cause most talk out their ass. Yeah, Ray Pooh man, it's a lot of people who talk out their ass. You know what I mean? I'm just not going to sit and talk about no topic that I'm not, I don't know a lot about. You know what I mean? Because um, I, I don't think that's cool. You know what I'm saying? I, I just don't think that's cool. Um, who, Who's shorty? That's my, that's my girlfriend, man. <laughs> All right. Uh, what we was gonna say? Uh, we gotta get some ice, cause the shit was sitting a little too long. And that's a big ass cup. Look, the whole Schnapple. Beautiful. 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 Uh, do that good. Did you think the nigga Surf was gonna do that good? <laughs> Hustle versus Kofi. Yo. Keep it a buck. I ain't think Surf was gonna do bad. I just didn't think it was going to be a 30 ball. You feel me? Because it's John John. I thought John John John's decent in my book. He got a, he, he he got some skills. He ain't no slouch. And he didn't do bad. I don't think he did bad last night. I think Surf just did better, a little better every round. And, again, I want to re-watch it. But at, from first watch and from what I saw, I felt like Surf had it. And, uh... Yeah, man, South the Surf. Like, I'm not going to be no hater, you know what I mean? Uh, when Surf loses and chokes, I'm going to say it, and I'm going to be like, you fucked up. But then when he does well, I'm going to give him his flowers, as I hope the world will do for me. You feel me? Like, if I'm cooking, give me my flowers. If I'm cooking, let me cook. You know what I mean? If I'm, if I'm fucking being horrible, then cool. I can't be mad at nobody but myself. Like, I failed. You know what I mean? Said Fit, what is the newest shoe you copped? Huh, what is the newest shoe? I show y'all my Yeezys. I had just got those on the Humble. It was real random. Like I just I just picked them up. Um I don't know if I got anything after the ones I showed y'all. The 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 glow in the dark Yeezys, I had just got a pair of those. <laughs> yeah, Surf was definitely like shut up. Shut up. I got a third round. Now I want y'all to shut up. Let me hear this shit. Fucking Chess was telling the crowd to shut up too. What's what, what what's going on with the shut the fuck ups, y'all? Y'all can't be talking to the crowd like that. These people paid their money to talk their shit. They don't want to shut up. They want to cheer, y'all. <laughs> Chess always do that. Chess be like, shut the fuck up, man. Ah. Ah. <laughs> Shut up, but they cheered. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, so, finishing the list, right? So, I have real name Brandon for the first battle. Uh, second battle, who battled after them? 
was it was it easy Arsene Lou Castro I thought Arsenal won I thought Arsenal won was it the best arse I ever seen no uh but I thought you know if I had to choose a winner for that battle I would choose arse I, w- I would say arse got it um yeah it wasn't it's not no lines that stuck in my head right now keep it a buck um actually beside the Lou line where he was like uh let me win and he kept saying let me win let me win let me win uh, th- I remember that but yeah it wasn't oh yeah new news knees uh, for the record, Mav had a new news knees ball when he battled Geechee, and I thought it was funny the first time when I heard it. You know what I'm saying? Remember he said something like new new knees? Yeah, he said new new knees. New new knees has been a topic. Multiple. Uh, yeah, Mav's right. Yeah, Mav Mav's new new knees ball was was better, and it was fresh because like. It was, I think it was like the first event Nunu hosted with Surf. Might have been the first. It was, it was when she first came back. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Me hanging off the bone like Nunu knees. That is fucking funny. And it was better. And it was better. So shout out to the, uh, to the Arsenal bar. But I think, um, I think math did it better. Thank you for that. Well, Justin Stacks, I appreciate you, Justin. Real shit. Good looking out. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> Me hanging off the bone like no, no knees. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> so it's funny how all the guys diss her. I mean, she's just present. I mean, you know, everybody knows her, so it's kind of like, you know. Yeah, it's all funny games. Everybody know Nunu. Nobody, you know, nobody be trying to play her like that. You know, she she family to all of them. Uh, So I think it's kind of like talking about Smack Beasley. Like, it's a it's a almost for sure reaction because everybody knows them. You understand? It's like a Chico. It's like. Oh, like, you know, like Smack's beard and Beasley's bald head. And now it's Nunu's knees. <laughs> Hilarious. Somebody said, I like it. <laughs> yeah, it's just a bar. Ain't, 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 no, uh, ain't, no, ain't, no, ain't no problems. Ain't no problems. Even Vixen said Nuno was taking the strap. Yeah, man. And uh, when Drake be in the building, they always throw some shots at her. And Drake, she be flirting with Drake. Whatever. All right, let's get back to battle rap. Um, So, cool. I had Arsenal. Then Easy and Chess went. Right? Uh-huh. Yes. Then Easy and Chess. Um, I initially had Chess. But, yes, I will admit, Easy was up there killing. The talk was different. I love his passion. Like, his delivery, when he delivers the message, is so dope to me. Because I'll be feeling his balls. Like, certain shit he said, I'll be like, damn, like, I felt that. But I felt chest last night, too, man. Like, I was I was fucking with both of them. So, I, I predicted they would have the battle of the night. And it turns out to be that they did have the battle with the night. It was the best back and forth. Um, it was the only battle for me where I couldn't call a clear winner, like, right away. Like, they both was going off. So, I'm happy about that. You know what I mean? I, I would have liked to see all the battles be that way. Um, like I thought with Geechee and Calico, I thought Geechee was going to be a lot better. Now, don't get me fucked up. He did well. You know what I mean? But it's like, when you put yourself at a certain level, you either got to be better or at that same 
wave. So if you're anything less than that, it just kind of seems like a fall off. And I don't know if it was round two or three, but I don't care what nobody tell me. He choked up there. He choked and he had to go into some regular raps that he knew because I felt like he he stopped. He didn't remember his rhymes and he's so easy and smooth that he don't make it obvious, which I love about Geechee. Because every time somebody choke, they're like, oh, my God, I'm choking. Or, oh, fuck, I'm choking. Like, they always make it so hot, and I fucking hate it. But every time Geechee chokes, he kind of just eases in it. He just stare at you like, yeah, homie. Uh-huh. Like, he'll do some cool, extra smooth shit. Then he starts freestyling. Because that's what I think he did. He started to freestyle. Now, drop a prop in the chat if you agree that the man choked and he freestyled. Now, he saved himself because nobody recorded a choke because he didn't stop rapping. So, throw a prop in the chat for Geechee. I don't know how to maneuver that. Hey. You understand? Not everybody can do that. So, I'm not saying that to shit on him. I'm saying that to yeah, yeah, yeah. I like popping bottles. Yeah. I like nasty hoes. Uh, I like fucking models. Uh, out they fancy clothes. Hey. I like, I like. Yeah, so I say that to to Thomo. So Melo said he definitely forgot his. Uh, yeah, he choked like four times. It was bad. Just didn't stop. Yeah. Yeah. So that's why I thought he wasn't on his A game. He wasn't chopping them. Like he had good lines, but then he had some of those whack lines where it's like, mm, this is a basic line. Um, but then he had that prep bar. That was dope. Um, a lot of people had prep bars. Uh, obviously, it was a current topic. Um, yeah, man. So, out of Geechee and Calico, I gave it to Calico. Because I thought Calico had better material. Now, before the battle, I totally, absolutely predicted that Geechee was going to wash him 3 up. Clearly lost that prediction. Because that's not what happened. You know what I mean? Um, and... Yeah, I don't know. I'm uh, Calico has been out so long, right? And I've always thought he won battles. You know what I mean? I've always thought he was good, but I just I just respect him a lot more. You know what I mean? Because it's like he's still out here doing his thing, and Geechee couldn't fuck with him. That's kind of crazy. You know what I mean? So shout out to Cal on that. Um, I was really like, okay, Cal, okay, you good in my book, boy, you good in my book, my guy, um, next, who do we have after that, was Shine and Hollow before Geechee, it's alright, we don't gotta go in no order, alright, yeah, so, uh, Hollow and Sean, I think me and uh me and uh hold on me and uh Ben spoke about that battle the most only because I had the most feedback about that battle because I was disappointed in that Sean like I feel like Sean. I don't know what happened to him within the last few performances. I don't know what's going on with him, but I hope everything is okay, and I hope he gets back to his regular state. <laughs> Somebody said that in a bar, too, yesterday. Something about bring it back to its original state. Uh, that was dope. I forgot who it was. Um, but Hollow the, Hollow the Dawn got the W, man. Shout out to Hollow the Dawn. He did his thing. A lot of people doubted him and counted him out. But when he won, they didn't want to talk about it. They was quiet. And I don't like to see Jay Black quiet. Because when he got opinions, he's very vocal about his opinions. But I feel like he was one of those guys that thought Shane Sean was going to win. If not him, then DNA. They both thought Sean was going to win. <laughs> In the commentary, 
I'm on the camera. All right. In the commentary, um, <laughs> DNA was like, it's just one of those things where you rap your boss to somebody and they react and then you, you perform it and it just don't go that way. That's what happened at night. <laughs> it's like, what? <laughs> yeah, obviously he rapped them shits to somebody and somebody okayed them bars and it just didn't, didn't go over. It didn't go over with the crowd. I don't know why. I don't know what happened, but it, it wasn't. It wasn't no shine that I'm used to seeing. That's all I'm going to say. That's all I'm going to say. I'm used to seeing shine win. I was not seeing him lose for a very long time. Once he got his new fan little, little style, he was killing everything in front of him. Balls were dope. Performance was dope. He was giving great aura. I don't know what happened. Definitely wasn't him yesterday. Well, I mean, it was him. But Hollow, Hollow 3 owed him. He 30 bulled him. And it's crazy because I didn't expect that shit to be no damn 30. Yeah, in my predictions, I had Hollow winning. But I didn't have him winning 3 0. I wanted it to be a 2 1 either way situation. But Hollow definitely won clear. Straight up. Straight up. All right. So shout out to Hollow the Dawn, man. Love that guy. Probably get him on the show to talk about his W. Um, because I did see him, uh, tweet, um, when he battled Nitty, he was at 85%. No, I'm lying. When he battled Nitty, he was at 75%. He said last night he was at 85%. His next battle, he's going to be at 95 So, he said he's inching his way back to that hundo. To the hundred percent hollow, you know what I mean? I'm just saying. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> That's funny. He said, "I thought he was going to hit an eight uh, <laughs> at some point." Yeah, yeah. Ray Poo, I agree. Ray Poo says hollow remains. His legendary stats, that is. Yeah, I agree. I never took that from Hollow, though. Because a lot of people was bad talking Hollow for a while, I, I, but I never did. I'm a huge Hollow fan. So I'm, I'm loyal. I'm loyal. I'm a loyal Hollow fan. And I, I don't never really have him losing when he go up against anybody. So it is what it is. Let's see. <laughs> <laughs> Justin said, I still think Sirius Jones being rum. That's over, man. Rum done got his check. Sirius Jones versus Swamp? They battled? No, it's on the super fight. Oh, it is on the super fight. And, oh, the super fight. We're going to get into that. You know what I mean? Everybody, I would appreciate it if y'all share the stream. Please share the stream. Um, every every share counts. Tell a friend to tell a friend. I really appreciate it. I really appreciate everybody who tunes in, man. I love this shit. I love this shit. I love this shit. I love talking with my people, getting opinions. You just get you get you get smarter. You get smarter when you learn from other folks. I'm just a uh, uh, I just love it. All right, who's next? Who is motherfucking next? Who? I ain't talking about reading movie. <laughs> so Hollow got it. Okay. Um. I think I think that was everybody, right? Yeah, that was everybody. So I said. I said Calico got it. <laughs> Here's the thing. Reading Mook, I don't know what that was. I kind of spaced out after a while. You know when you watch your TV and you just kind of look at the screen, right? And you just look at the screen and you kind of just, you looking at it, but you not watching it. It's kind of just watching you. That's what happened to me when I was watching Mook and, and Reed 
all I heard was New York, Philly, Philly, New York, dollar bill. <laughs> that that's what that's what I heard. I don't know what what happened. You know what I mean? Uh, so uh, Bello said I was doing random shit. Okay, I ain't mad at you because I was too after a while. What was the word chess and the block captain? What? what? Oh, battle of the night. Chess, chess and easy was battle of the night. Um, everybody pumped it up too much. Listen, when they first, uh, when they first announced the read and move battle, I was like, why now? Like it, it's died out to me. Like I didn't, I didn't care to see that. I don't care about the history. I didn't care to see it. So for me, it was just like, whatever. Like I wasn't mad at it because I was happy to see chess and easy. I was happy to see hollow and shine. And um, I was happy to see Geechee and Calico. So that was enough for me. That was enough for me. I thought the card was put together well. Like, they put together a good card. Um, and overall, the results were good as well. So, bravo to a successful event. Um, you know, you're just not always going to get a perfect situation. And that's just what it is. Some people, uh, nobody choked. So, awesome, right? Every, at least everybody wrote. But uh, Ben did bring up a good point. He was saying, like, oh, um, was it better than Civil War, though? Right? Was it better? At the end of the day, URL still wins because they both URL events, right? It's kind of like, who's better, myself or myself, right? Uh, so, you know, shout out to them for just giving us multiple cards to even talk about. But... I would probably say Civil War. I liked I liked I liked Twerk and Loso on Civil War. I liked Real Sick um on Civil War. I liked who else was on that joint? It's a couple It was a couple good joints. Yeah, Top and Mike P. That was dope. That was crazy. I like those battles. Okay, Chaos and Jay. Yeah, I yeah, I definitely had to say Civil War now. Civil War. Uh huh. Probably just had better matchups. You know what I mean? Yeah, Swamp and Age versus Danny and Tink. Yep, that's two on two. That was dope. So I would say, yeah, Civil War. Civil War was better. Civil War was better. I would probably had. I would appreciate it if Civil War was on caffeine too, you know? Now I'm so used to things being on caffeine that when it's not, I'm like, yo, what the fuck? Why? Why y'all doing that? You know what I mean? But we're going to talk about the Super Fight card. And we'll talk about uh the battles that are on. Uh, um. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. No, no, no. You don't love me and I know now Cause you left me, baby <laughs> Alright, what are we doing? Alright, All right, let's see, let's see, let's see what we doing, baby Let's see what we doing, what we doing, what we do Did they post the, um They post the card, right? Uh, it, it, I thought I had it here already, but I don't. All right. Thanks, baby. All right. So we got the super fight card. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. We're going to start from the top to the bottom. All right. Oh, right. Let's start from the bottom to the top. All right. From the bottom to the top. Uh, started from the bottom now here, you know? MVP versus versus. Oh, mad Spanish. MVP versus Cuban. MVP versus Cuban. What do y'all think? MVP versus Cuban. Talk to me. 
talk to me what are we talking about <laughs> yeah you took the words right out of my mouth uh i'm probably not gonna tune in nah i mean i don't care i mean at the end of the day i'll watch uh whoever wins wins all right whatever uh rada versus emerson kennedy good to see rada and Kem- uh, kennedy on a card uh shout out to both of them right we got the silk rider silk shirt rider we got emerson kennedy um what do y'all think what what what's the verdict on that what's the verdict who who getting that so i said ek21 i see rider i see ek i see ek i see rider so it looks debatable right uh it looks like 2-1 either way 2-1 either way i i think it i will be comfortable with saying 2-1 either way and this could be a preference battle too, right? This this could be a preference battle, right? Based on who you like more, right? Um, next is Cortez, Murdev Gang Representer versus Jada Nightwing. Now, I'm going to say Cortez all the way, not only because he's my boy. It's also because Jay is like a hit or miss for me. Like, if Jay hit... He hit, and then if he don't, he don't, right? Um, sometimes I don't like his outbursts, you know. Sometimes relax. I be thinking, I'm like, all right, buddy. I, you, I didn't like his whole Avengers shit, but then we spoke about that, uh, and then I watched the Avengers. I understood it, but still, I, I, I just feel a way about being in hip hop and somebody having this huge fucking comic book bar and i like i like avengers like I, i'm cool with the superhero bars i am a hundred percent cool with the superhero bars but don't bring me the fucking props too and like i'm not gonna talk about it no more because i feel like i'll be od and on him with that i do um also he wears fake polo you can't battle me and wear fake polo because i'm gonna smoke your boots you understand smoke your boots you're gonna die out there. You know what I mean? What do y'all think? What do y'all think? Who's gonna get it? Cortez or Jay? Come on, y'all. Let's go. Let's get this chat moving a little faster. Alright? Fake polo. <laughs> polo Association. Uh, it seems like you guys agree with me. Cool. Cool's gonna take that. Cause a vet, man. Right? Cause a vet. Cause always underrated. You know, a lot of people be, you know, coming for core. But Cole consistently puts out good material. And, you know, he loves this shit. He loves Battle Rap. So, I think he's definitely going to put on and not going to take no L to Jay Nightwing. You know what I mean? He knows he knows what a, what a loss to a rookie could do to his career. And I just don't think he's going to take that kind of L in no shape or form. You feel me? So, I think Cortez is going get to him, get him out of here. You know what I mean? But I'm definitely going to hit him up right after I get off live with y'all to make sure that he's body bagging him. I want to hear some shit. And next time I speak to y'all on Tuesday, I'm going to let y'all know how bad he's going to die. You understand? Not if he's going to die, how bad he's going to die. Gotcha. Next, we got Danny Meyer versus Fawns. Now, that's a similar thing to me. They both bar out. I like Fonz, though. I, I had slept on him primarily. I did sleep on him. But then I seen a couple of his performances, and, and he impressed me. Um, So, shit, I go on the limb here and say Fonz, man. A lot of people like Danny. I ain't too crazy of a Danny fan. But I, I, I fuck around. Might say Fonz 2-1. 2-1 Fonz. Fuck it. Serious Jones versus Swamp. That's weird to me. I didn't. See that coming? I don't know what kind of back and forth they had to kind of build up to that. I didn't see it coming, but I don't know. They both kind of got like this easy going flow type shit. And I don't know. Swamp, he be talking that real shit. But then sometimes 
He just got to make sure there's bars in that. He can't just over talk. You, you got to bar out. And Sirius Jones is a vet. He's been in this game a very long time. So, you know, I, I really just don't know. I really just don't know on this one. I'm going to let Jesus take the wheel on this one. <laughs> take the wheel, Jesus. I don't know. Last but not least, Miss Hustle and Coffee. Now, this battle was supposed to go down several events ago. So, they finally going to get it off. Um, I know it was booked. Canceled because Hustle was, like, recovering from surgery. Um, then for some other reason and some other reason that I don't know or care for. But now they're going to battle. So, um, I love to see cards like this, right? I don't always want to see females on an all-female card like this total segregation shit. Like, I love having females on on regular cards. Like, let's just be integrated. Like, let's just let's just integrate this shit and let us be on cards right with the greats. You know what I mean? We've earned it. We've earned it. Now, Hustle and Coffee, man, I don't know. I felt like the way Coffee was talking spicy, she might have had the material to win, you know? I felt like when they was going back and forth, she was trying to really smoke Hustle's boots. So, this is going to be a good battle. This is going to be a good battle. Um, it's going to be a good battle. But I don't see no, 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 I don't think it's going to be a clear win here with these females. I think it's, I mean, fuck around, this is going to be battle with a night. This is battle with a night for me. I think their battle is going to be more entertaining than every battle on this card. They're gonna they're gonna own the night. So shout out to Kofi and Miss Hustle holding out for the ladies and I I feel like the ladies are gonna have the best card. I mean the best battle. So bow, stamp that shit. Boom. <laughs> and then the Drake card. So we got Jazz and, and Gaddis and then Twerk and Rock. Uh Jazz and Gaddis, y'all know how I feel about that. I don't know who the fuck wants to see that, but I'm pretty sure Jazz fans is happy that she's coming back. So shout out to her. Um, and Gaddis fans is happy that she is returning um, to, to continue to battle after her uh, previous win against Official. So shout out to Gaddis, man. Um, always is a professional, does her thing, comes in, does her work, and she's nice. So I think she's going to bring it to Jazz the Rapper. Um, I, I also think Jazz is... Um, smart, and she's going to prep. Uh, she's going to make sure she is ready for this battle. Um, and you know she's been prepping already for a minute. Uh, since since Gattles, since Gattis battled official, this battle has been pretty much locked in. It's pretty much locked in. So she's had enough time to prepare. So, you know. <laughs> I'm dead. Melo said Jazz had to get her stud bars off. Nah, that's what I said. I had said, look, if you have three rounds for Misfit, right, and you could battle any other female, it would be Gaddis. Gaddis is the most parallel to me than any other female. You can use stud bars. You can use grind time bars. You can use uh, lesbian bars. You can use all your strap-on bars. You could use pretty dyke bars because we both pretty. I think we the prettiest dykes in the game, if you ask me. <laughs> but yeah, man, th that that was the joke I had made about it. It was funny. Uh, it was it was funny. So whatever, it made me laugh. Um, but yeah, man, shout out to both of them. At the end of the day, uh, Jazz and Gaddis, um, a female on the card like that. So that's good. Uh, shout out to both of them, and. Who else we got? Oh, yeah. Twerk and Rock. That's going to be crazy. Now, I want the, I'm strapped in. And I want the, how am I still getting the reaction? I need those two guys to show up. Now, if those two guys show up, oh, it's going to be a crazy night. It's going to be a crazy night. And I need that to happen. And I need nobody to choke. I need everybody to be on motherfucking point. 
Now, as far as the name of the event, Till Death Do Us Part. When I first heard that, I instantly thought, oh, this is a Kings versus Queens event. I don't know who did the marketing, but I, I, why Death Do Us Part? I want, I want, I'm, I'm, maybe we should talk to bees on that. Who came up with that name? Because it sounds so dope for a King versus Queens card. I thought Babs was about to pop out and be like, give it up for the ladies. Shout out to Babs. Fucking love Babs holding it down for Brooklyn and Queen of the Ring. You know what I mean? Uh, but yeah, cool. Uh, cool, cool, cool. I'm excited to see who else is going to be on that card. But so far, it sounds good. So far, it sounds good. So far, it counts sounds good. Pretty fucking good. And I am excited. Uh, that one is on the 30th? Yes. That one's on the 30th. And the super fight is the 9th? Yes. So the super fight is October 9th. Uh, to Duff Do Us Part is October 30th. And I will say something. Yesterday when I was watching the battles, specifically Easy to Block and Chess, I wanted to battle. I did. I was like, damn. Maybe I should get on the next card. A lot of people has been asking me to get on the card, asking me to come back. And I'm just like, who should I smoke that makes sense? Obviously, you know, this whole jazz shit is ridiculous, so ain't nobody got time for that. But I'm thinking, you know, I know a lot of the little, the newbies, been acting real on they high horse. A lot of people been talking little side shots at me. I be peeping. But I'm kind of like Beyonce. I don't respond to everything. If I responded to everything, I'd be a miserable ass bitch, y'all. <laughs> I would not be able to, like, live. Because uh, you just got to know to chill, man. Or, everything is not that deep. At least not to me, man. Like, it's just not that deep. And that's how I treat it. But battle rap, I'm not going to lie. I was watching chess. I was like, man. When he said, I miss y'all. That would have been, that. that's how I would have felt up there after getting, like, the energy. There's no better feeling than, than getting that reaction. And you just feel like, ah. Because y'all know. What? What about energy? It's never destroyed. It's always transferred. So when you get that energy from the crowd and it's transformed to you, that shit is electrifying. Electrifying. And you can, you can fucking, you can deliver punchlines that'll bring that energy right back to the crowd and have them fucking knocking out they boots, man. This is real shit. (laughs) <laughs> they said you could take Shuni because of the movie. Yo, I legit battled Shuni in the movie. You know what's funny too, right? I'm going to tell you a story about that. Um, if y'all not aware, me and Shuni the Rapper was in a movie that aired on Netflix. It's called The 40-Year-Old Version, right? And that's basically about uh, a woman who's in her 40s that starts to consider to be a, a rapper. And um, the part that we're in, she enters a, a, a Queen of the Ring event, and we're up there battling each other. Now, the only information, so Babs calls my phone, right? She's like, yo, Fit, you know, I got some good news. You know, they want you to be in a movie. And I'm like, oh, shit, that's what's up. I'm like, yo, tell me a little bit more about it. You know, she says, it, it's directed and produced by Ryder Blank. Blank. Um, uh, 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 Lena White, wait, yeah, Lena Waith. Um, you know, she mentioned a lot of like heavy hitters. I'm like, yo, all right, cool. What it's about? She was like, yeah, like she told me the concept of the movie or whatever the case may be. And I was like, all right, cool. So what they need from me? Like, do I need to remember lines? What I gotta do? She was like, look, all you gotta do is prepare a battle. And I'm like, all right, cool. Who am I battling? She said, Shuni the rapper. She said, so basically, I'm like, so wait, so. So write like a whole battle or whatever? She was like, yeah, like three rounds. Yo. I wrote three rounds for Shuni. 
three rounds, three whole rounds. And when we got there, I only performed like the first five seconds. <laughs> Yo, was I tight? Yeah, I was tight. Cause I prepared, I prepared a whole battle to only spit like the first five seconds of the of the of the shit, and then they kept recording. Obviously, the same, you know, five seconds, and it's pre-recorded, right? So my biggest thing was like, yo, fit, don't choke. This is a movie, so I didn't choke, right? I didn't choke. Um, everybody else did though. Everybody else kept fucking up and and retaking and shit. But I I got I got through my shit one take one shit because I was so determined not to choke. Because I thought it was a real battle. Now, I don't know if everybody's headspace was where mine was at. But I was the only one. I don't know if I was the only one who thought it was a real battle. But I feel like they prepared more, too. Because, obviously, I had spit a whole round. They didn't tell me cutting nothing. They just was rolling. And it was like, after the round, it was like, oh, shit. <laughs> All right, cool. Now we need you to just do another take. But you can stop, like, at the fourth bar type shit. <laughs> So they let me get the round off, uh, and then we did it. But it was cool, whatever. I, I battled Shuni, and then um, uh, who else was on there? Misunderstood and Noma Bates battled each other, um, and it was a great experience, right? It was the first movie I've ever been a part of. Um, you know, I I get checks from it still, so. I, I I probably will get checks from that movie till the day I die. So, you know, that also made me want to be in my movie bag. Like, oh, like, I look good on the big screen. Like, I could do this. Like, especially if it's like a rap character or some shit. Psh. But shout out to that producer, Rada, because it wasn't the first time I had met her. The first time I met her, she actually threw me a script to Empire, and she had me um audition for 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 one of the roles in Empire, obviously I didn't get the role, but it I thought it was so dope that when that came across her lap, like that opportunity that she threw me the alley oop, like oh I, I I thought of rappers, I thought of you, and I I think you should be good for this role. Granted, I probably would have never got the role because it was playing the daughter of Chris Rock. Uh, you know, Frida, I don't know if you watch Empire, but the character's name was Frida. And, huh? Frida? Breezy? Breezy. I don't know, I don't care her real name, but in, in the in the show, her name is Frida. Um, so whatever that role was, that was, that was gonna be me. Um, but when you think about it, it, it probably wouldn't have made sense. Because the role was specifically for African American female, and I guess like technically I am an African American female, but like you know, I probably wouldn't be able to pass as Chris Rock's daughter. You know what I'm saying? So, boo! But they gassed me like they had me going because after the first audition, they hit me back. They was like, all right, cool. Are you currently like signed to a record label? Like, do we need permissions to get your 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 your, your lyrics like released? And I was like, oh, shit, I'm about to get this role. And then like they're they're hitting me up, hitting me up, hitting me up like every day. And then one day the hits to stop. And I was like, oh, wait, what happened? And then, you know, they filled the role. They must have found someone better than me. But I remember in that audition room and I'm doing the tape. I'm pretty sure when I become like a billionaire, that's going to pop up somewhere. But um, like one of the lines was like, I'm not playing with you, Lucius. This is really starting to get to me, man. Yo, I was in there really acting like I was like, this is really starting to get to me. How you going to do this to me, Lucius? <laughs> it's hilarious. I just be cracking myself up. But it was cool. It was a good experience. Cheers to y'all. Cheers. But I think she does die on the show, right? Somebody asked, you seen what happened to her? Oh, I, th uh, I think, yeah, I think she does die. But it's... I mean, no, nah, I mean, that show bend over. Yeah. 
Oh yeah, nah, yeah, it it kind of like just been done. I'm done. Oh, but did y'all all see? Oh my God, what is happening with Rock right now? I can't even, I can't even show you, yo, yo, I love my boy Rock, but, yo, yo, what's going on with your man's, with this Burberry fit he got going on here, what, what, what's happening, what, look, yo, yo, Rock, chill, Rock, this, this is a perfect example, like, you just, you just don't need this much Burberry on you, my guy, yo, yo, you know what I mean, like, it's not needed with the Adidas sock. It's not needed. You ain't had to do that. You know what I mean? That and it's not the same pattern either. It's not the same Burberry pattern. You get it be tight. You get it be tight. Like if you wanna know how to dress in like a pool party setting, yo fit fit is that bitch. I'll give some tips. You feel me? Like <laughs> that's a that's a pool party fit right there. Come on. Did did y'all see did y'all see fit in Cabo? Oh, nobody fucking with my fit game. A hundred, a hundred, no one. Like what? That's a fit. And you know, Rock, that's my baby. I love you, my God. But you wildin' with that fit on? You know what I mean? I love you, but that's not a fit. That's a miss, my God. I love you though. Like I do. Like that's why I'm telling you because I love you. I wouldn't put you on if I didn't care. You know what I mean? Come on. Y'all should be following me on the gram if y'all really love me. You know, if you really love me, y'all need to follow me on the gram. I right, mean, the pool party looked real lit. Man, I'm not there. <laughs> and no more red context. Now, nah, I mean, I be liking when Rock do his costume shit. I like the Dracula shit. I, I, I think we could keep that going. Um, but shout out to Yoshi when she said you and your man be fighting over costumes. That was a funny ball. That was funny. That was funny. Can't even hate on it, but that was funny. You know what I mean? Uh, you gotta love it. But yeah, man, before we get up out of here, man, here's a, here's a public service announcement. Um, to anybody who ever feels the urge to disrespect me. Listen. I've been too nice for too long. In so many different ways. Right. I'm fire. I. I, I can write. I, I, I will say. I, I'm probably one of the best female battle rappers. That write their own shit. Now let's be clear. Because. Uh, <laughs> based on current events. We know a lot of girls don't even pen their own shit. You know what I mean. Um, yeah, chill, stop playing with me, because the angry fit is not the fit you want to see, it's just not, you know, let's keep the political podcast fit, let's keep her, you know, she's nice, she likes people, you know, let's keep that energy, like, Let's just be respectful. Let's be respectful. Because the misfit slander, it can't be tolerated. You understand? I work too hard. You know what I mean? I feel like I've I've did I've done what I had to do to not get the stupid shit. You know what I mean? And now, like, I'm I'm a little excited, and I kind of want to battle now. So, like, I like this energy. It feels good. You know what I mean? So, we're going to keep that energy. And, and, and on that note, you know what I mean? Shout out to everybody on the chat. Prop game, where is y'all at? <gasps> Show me some hey. love. So fits some Ooh. love out here, baby. Uh, Prop game yeah, with you yeah, yeah, yeah. I like popping bottles. Let's yeah. go. I like nasty. Ooh, I like fucking models. Uh, 
out they fancy clothes. I lie, 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 I lie. I like popping bottles. I like fancy hoes. I like fucking models. Out they fancy clothes. I lie, 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 I lie. Don't spill my drink. Tell nigga watch your step. So they like me, y'all are set uh -huh. I be writing for the best But I'm pricey, cut the check Let's Just invite me for the, for the sex. sex So, so I, I pipe the then I left All this ice that's on my neck Get a hype and leave a wet This ain't high key, I'm a vet And bitch, I'm spicy, show respect Who these hoes, they my me they See the way they eye me You want that work, I got that work Look, baby, you can hire me Foles don't want no robbery on All my shit, they riding me Take your shine, you waste your time I take what's mine, that's robbery Y'all don't want no drama, please She's so cold, I gotta be See it, then I like it, then I buy it That's the finer things yeah. I like popping bottles yeah. I like nasty hoes uh. I like fucking models uh. Out they fancy clothes hey. I lie, 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 I lie I like Yo. popping bottles uh. I like nasty hoes Appreciate that, I like Leo. fucking models I don't know. Out they fancy Please clothes go. I lie, I lie, I lie, I lie, I lie, I lie Girl at home, I like it when you bring her with you. So I can mingle with you. I can spend some singles with you. Come and take a flick with fish so you can see the bigger picture. Bigger figures everywhere I go. I gotta sip the liquor with a hitter just in case a chicken head's feeling better. I ain't got no time for that. Hate me, yeah, I'm fine with that. You trying to start some drama? Cool, I'll put one in your starter cot. I'll be where the dollars at. Flipped it, then I got it back. Make you famous, yeah, you made it, bitch, and now you on the Mac. Trolling, here's my autograph. I will put wit in you, nigga. I ain't even pausing that. You know why? Because I'm the motherfucking goat. How many times I got to remind these bitches? Bad, bad, who won't smoke? I cut a throw and leave your ass with the fishes. Everything I'm doing, nothing more than repetition. I ain't with the play and looking for no recognition. But if you want to slay for a we can hit him like a call out of prison. No calls, no visits. Nah, man, you know I love y'all. I love y'all. Appreciate the props, man. Uh, appreciate the love. Of course, if you didn't catch the whole episode, you can catch it on the YouTube, Miss.Fit. That's M-S-D-O-T-F-I-T. Um, each and every episode gets uploaded to the YouTube, so please subscribe to my YouTube channel. And please become a member to the YouTube channel um, and contribute because uh, that's how we stay alive. That's how we stay open. That's how we feed our families. Um, it's through this shit right here, man. So thank you all. Misfit. Murder gang. This is my dumb advice. Bow, let's get it. Hey yo, what's good? Misfit Murder gang. This is my dumb advice. Bow.